first things I felt like saying when I came here was like, okay, what can you do? What can you do? <laughs> um, um, smoke. Smoke. We can smoke very well. Okay. <laughs> I love the interaction. I love the fact that I have this human experience that, that is actually so uh, full of semi-surprises and is so immediate. It's amazing. I think that's great. It's a little bit about going on a treasure hunt. You know, I, I start here, but then I might end up over there. And that's what's kind of fun, because it's like little leads or clues that bring you to the next point, And then another lead or clue brings you to the point after that. And, that's kind of what I like about it, is that it always ends up something that I could have never seen at the beginning. And I love looking at people, so I, I'm fascinated at their choices and what they do and why and how certain things are unexpected or comic for not necessarily any reason um, because of a series of circumstances. And yeah, I, I, I think it's enormously enjoyable. I feel that I get to witness something that like, I, I think, and I've had this on quite a few occasions when I make something, I, I feel it's me and it's not me. And this thing of me being a part of something that I can't, I, I, I might have put something together and it has a certain flow to it and I don't know where it comes from, I don't know. And part of it, partly in my mind I go, oh, I did that. And then I go, no, but I didn't do that, it was something else. Or I know that sounds, it's not, it's, it might sound very esoteric and I don't mean it that way, but it's, it's this, I find it very interesting to not know, you know, or to at least be in that space of, of, of it being a part of a much greater experience that I don't, I don't know about or understand. Not knowing opens you up to so many different choices. Whereas if you go in and you go, I know, then you're narrowing your path a little bit, aren't you? I have to be open to the fact of what I see. So if I decide already what I'm going to look at, then I'm already defining it. And I don't want to yet. So I have to be open to the point that of nothing, I have to be open to the fact of not knowing and people don't want that. They want you to tell them exactly what it is you think at every time. And I, I have to say, I don't know, because I, I, I don't want to define it yet. I mean, that's really important in creative process. You can't decide it at the beginning. It's like um, a collective story. Yeah. It's like a little bit of me and a little bit of them.